What's up, beautiful people? Welcome back to Toy CTV. We are on episode number six. And this show is getting crazy. Okay. So, last episode, everything is starting to unfold. Okay. Everything is starting to unfold. So, Norm is on his Law and Order SVU detective, CSI detective, NCIS detective, all the detective shows. He owned his detective stuff okay because in the computer he saw that all the overseers were voted from 31 to 33 so what the heck is going on in 31 and then when they was uh you know him and chet was investigating 32 they had on the blood a blood on the wall about you don't know what's going on over here or something like that and then that saying they said i forgot the saying but yes what is going on in 31? I want to know, okay? So then we have Lucy and... No, no, no. Then we go to Maximus because we didn't see Maximus in the last episode. Maximus and Thaddeus are ch chums, buddies, and everything. And laughing it up and doing all this because they found a head. They happy. And so Thaddeus, not Thaddeus, Maximus thought he could trust Thaddeus. And he told him who he really was. And of course, Thaddeus, being a squire, being by the book of the brotherhood, they're going to kill you, Max. He's like, no, not if we don't tell him. He go, Thaddeus, I can't do that. Uh-uh, no. He takes the core out of the suit, the, the robot suit. And now, Maximus can't move, can't do nothing, can't get out. So, and Daddy is gone with the head. I hope Maximus find him and off him, okay? So, and I was giving uh, Daddy is the benefit of the doubt when he told him the story of why they was beating up Max. I was like, oh, okay, I, I'll give you a little pass. But now, no. Get him, Max, okay? Then Lucy found Maximus. And Max was about to get eaten up by these big behind roaches and so they go off they devise this plan which i'm like it's not gonna work because she like i'll i'll help you find the head you take me back where you are in exchange for the t60 and guns maximus don't have that kind of pull first of all they're gonna be mad at you and trying to kill you for for king titus being dead okay and then so they go about they way they come across, come to this bridge where they see these two people. And they like, are you armed? They like, no. And they like, are you armed? They like, no. And Lucy's like, you're lying. Girl, shut up. <laughs> shut up, okay? And then when he's like, give me the gun, she's like, no, I'm not going to give you the gun. Girl, you're too naive. And she's like, let's just hold our hands up. Walk across the bridge, everybody take a deep breath, and we're just gonna go on our way. No. Max has been in this world. You have not. You're so not even gullible. Stop it. So they pass each other, and of course, a shootout commence. Max killed him. Max gets shot. So they gotta go find somewhere to uh to uh fix Max, because he's losing a lot of blood from he said it was a grace, but no, it was a shot. And so they come to this clinic place. Lucy just goes in, gun the guns are blazing. Not waiting on Max, not nothing. So Max go in, trying to find her. And it's clean in here. Like, people been using this. And so he gets captured. They wake up from, because they gassed them. They wake up, they are in a vault. Is this 31? Or this is a whole different other vault? So, what, or was it just those three? 31, 32, and 33. I need some answers, okay? Oh, we also found out that Steph is from 31, too. And Norm asked her, asked her, you know, what's so different about 31? And she's like, oh, I don't know. I guess the mashed potatoes just taste better. And he was like, that's the same thing my daddy said. Steph, I'm looking at you, too, girl. I'm looking at you. So, if this is your first time here... Welcome to Toy You See. Oh, wait a minute before I get to that. Betty, I'm looking at her too. Because Betty was an overseer before. 
and she a little fishy, her little faces. When Max come and ask her something, and she and he walk off, and her facial expression change. We on to you too, Betty. I'm on to you. We on to you. Y'all done seen it, but I'm on to you too, Betty. So, anywho, y'all can tell I'm excited to see this episode. So, if this is your first time here, welcome to Toya CTV. Thank you for tuning in. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when I drop a video. If you want to see the full unedited reaction, go ahead and click the link below for my Patreon. And if you want to further support the channel here on YouTube, Go to my channel and click the join button and join my membership. So yes, so enough talking. Let's get right into it. So it's about to start raining. I hope it don't start thundering and lightning. If so, I'm going to have to start recording and wait till it's finished because you, you're going to be it. You're going to hear it on here. Oh, I hear a little bit of thunder already. <laughs> oh, no. Skip recap. Hello there. Yep, it's me. Cooper. Cooper. Star of stage. Cowboy Cooper. But I'm not here today to talk to you about my latest picture. Yeah. <laughs> yes, a vault. But that one say four. Vault four? A song she sings now that right there is vault four's three foot thick vault four is that where max and lucy is now each one of these underground birds comes with all the modern amenities you've come to expect from our rip roaring republic hmm. meet the hawthorns now this isn't just your average the hawthorns and we'll be living and working right here in vault four Leading a community governed entirely by scientists. Wait a second. Oh, not yet, but uh, our family and a group of 80 volunteers will be conducting a five-year trial of Vault 4. Oh. Demonstrate to the world that no matter what comes our way, America will be ready. Five years. Yeah, it's really lovely to meet you. Thanks for coming out. So Vault 4, how many vaults are there? Bud Askins I overseer of Southern California operations. I uh, came over to Vault Tech in Q3 after a 10 year stint in West Tech. West Tech? Oh, I'm uh, very familiar with you guys. You designed the T45 power armor. Oh. No, I, I oversaw the, the rollout. So they already designed that um, armor. It sounds complicated, but the future of all humanity comes down to one word. No, it's uh, management. Oh. Remember death by management? Death of management or something like that on the wall? What a, a rap party for this. All right, we go for a couple of hours. We shake a few hands. It's in our house. Uh oh. The things I'm going to do here never cease to amaze. <laughs> Roosevelt, I'm sorry you can't come, buddy. I'm heading into enemy territory. <laughs> Mr. Howard. Mr. Howard. What else? Oh, dude. <laughs> I, Bartholomew Codsworth, am ever ready to serve. <laughs> oh, that's the robot's voice. When you finish your shift, we can head up and party in the hot tub. What do you think of that? Oh, no. No, no. no thank you. Uh -huh. That is the robot's voice. You hear I lost a movie over these ads? Yeah, I showed up set. The actors wouldn't come out of their trailers. Oh, wow. Bonnie Lewis said it was on moral grounds. Bonnie Lewis? She's done more ads than a fucking billboard. Oh! Fucking Hollywood rats. I'm telling you, radical is sweeping through Hollywood. I mean, I did my bits in the same gravy train. Sell my vocal rights to that spinning robot. Oh, okay. Guess how much they paid me for that? Ten million? <laughs> no, I got a hundred and eighty six free tax. A hundred eighty six what? Dollars? I hope it was a hundred and eighty six thousand. Are y'all here for the 
Ice cream social, I'm afraid I got some bad news for you. Uh, let's get to it, shall we? Shall we? Destroying a legitimate business? That's illegal around these parts. Destroying an illiz a, a legitimate business? <coughs> oh my gosh! Title card. Yes! Using it's teeth for ammunition. Each other up there, aren't they? I'm fine. I'm fine. Ooh, the needle! The needle! <laughs> and we found his armor. Our surface foragers are bringing it back now. Oh! oh. Thank you. It's not ideal for us to face that, but I gotta admit, it sure feels good to be back in the vault. I was born on the surface. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh sorry. I, I didn't know. You seem so normal. <laughs> My we were lucky to find such a hospitable community here in Vault 4. But you, you don't smell sex? good. You want to have sex? You mean use my cock? What? Yeah. Uh, but for some guys, you know, when they make it move, it gets all big and hard like a big pimple and then it pops. What? Did he talk about blue balls? What, what is he talking about? And sir, really? Oh, ho, ho. you get you got somebody that's giving up freely, and you like I'm a knight of the brotherhood. We're not supposed to do that. <laughs> Who gonna know? But y'all too. <laughs> Test subjects. What? So I'm fishy with four. I think these people are trying to trap us here. No, they're not. And some of these people are from the surface. Thank you. This is a cult. <laughs> it's not a cult. Everyone smile. Titus, this is a safe place. I don't know, Lucy. Sorry to interrupt your breakfast, but our overseer wanted to say a quick hello. Overseer Benjamin. Woo! Hey, guys. Just wanted to say hi. Hello. And obviously, welcome. Wait a minute. Why he only have one eye? Stay out of level 12. Obviously, we prefer you not go there. <laughs> Any questions or concerns? Yes, why do you only have one eye? Bathrooms, birdies available. What? <gasps> he got a nose on his forehead. Look at his hand. Oh, what is going on here in Vault 4? <gasps> Her eyes are glowing. <gasps> she got what? Have a nice day. Are these aliens? What what's going on here? Oh, they did say test subjects. Are what? Maybe they did something to I don't know. But that one eye? Okay, no. The glowing eyes? No. Oh my gosh. Here we go with the music. I think about it. What in showbiz? Buying us a ranch up in Bakersfield. Mm -hmm. Got me second guessing the whole city life. Mm. She got a galaxy watch. Oh, come on. You've seen these around. Oh, here come the thunder. I need this job, Coop. It guarantees us a spot in the vault. We got money. Oh. We got spot. One of the good vaults. What do you mean, one of the good vaults? What that mean? What does that mean? I'm doing what I can. What does that mean, girl? We make movies, Charlie. Yeah, we 
American Dream has me getting shot in the ass by you all day. You got <laughs> five acres in Tarzan. I think you're doing all right. Yeah, it don't matter, Coop. Voltex the fucking devil. Uh-oh. You really think Boris devil? Well, the U.S. government has outsourced the survival of the human race to Voltec. <laughs> Voltec is a private corporation. It okay. has a fiduciary responsibility to make money for its investors. And how does it make money? But they can't sell Volts if these peace negotiations go through. So mm -hmm. Voltec has the fiduciary responsibility to make sure. Oh. Look. You should come to the meeting. You should learn the truth about where your wife works. Hollywood forever? What is that, funeral home? What? Go, Coop, because I want to know. <laughs> It's going to be hard on her. That's all. What is? You know, no dogs in the vaults. No. That's just the, um, that's the policy. Why is she looking like that? Who, who, who makes the rules? Because no dogs allowed. That is a new rule. Somebody decided that and didn't share it with fucking anyone. Uh-oh. I didn't go to war defending that freedom so that I could live in a cellar under the boot heel of Chairman Bud Askin. And while you were away at war, I stayed home. Oh, is this the start of the separation of their marriage? Marriage? There will be no dogs in the vault, and no, none of it is ideal. But if billions of people are going to lose their lives, I will do whatever it takes to make sure the people I love, that is you and that is Jamie, aren't among them. She got a point too. Hard to make sure we go into a special vault for management. Where we will oversee all of the other vaults. Overseers. Okay, so she for the vault and Coop seem like he not for the vault. This is this is how they start dividing. <laughs> what? How is he seeing through those? It says goosey. Goosey. You're from here? Five generations. And brought up. Huh. Why do you have one eye? Because you have one eye. So many, uh, people here seem to be refugees from the surface. Tell me about it. Oh, these people, am I right? <laughs> oh! I grabbed a moldy one. <clears throat> what do you mean by that? A moldy one. You won't find anyone more open minded than me. A moldy what? I think what you're doing here is a really good thing. I saw what was left of Shady Sands and an entire city just destroyed in an instant. It's like you can't make a funny joke about it without offending these guys. It was <laughs> one funny joke I told on maybe ten occasions. Ten occasions? I forget. All I know is it was a huge bomb. Oh. No, that is not funny. Uh. What's on level 12 and why can't we go there? Oh! We don't talk about that. What's the matter with you? Sorry, I, I... You should go now. I only wanted to... Goodbye, Goosey. Goosey. What's on level 12? Skedaddle. Not skedaddle. She gonna go to level 12, watch. She gonna go to level 12. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he? He's so happy he found it. They found it. Uh oh. What? What? Oh yeah, no core. Now how did they find that though? He covered it up. It, they no one was around, so how did they find that? Oh, the fusion core. You can't take that. All the power going to go out, right? Lord Maximus. How are we just in collect on here? Does it matter? I'm leaving soon. No, you're not. Look how she looking. Aren't I? 
some people who come here have a hard time adjusting to finally feeling safe. Here, unit 42B. How about you sleep in a room of your own tonight? Oh. Uh oh. Dog, get from over here. Oh, he gonna be all up in it because he gonna have a hot shower, a nice bed, good amenities. Iggy, get from over here. Hey, get from over here. Everybody is just a smiling, happy go lucky. Oh, come on, Thunder, hush. Please, Rain, hold off. Let me finish watching this. Not a welcome basket. They're going to reel him right on in so he don't want to leave. Birdie and your friends vault for. Oh. He can use a real toilet, not sitting on no tires. Oh Lord, this music. Did he lick that? He licked the soap? <laughs> okay, Max. <laughs> he don't know how to act. He uh, He's not going to leave. Caviar? How the heck they get caviar? Let's see if he like these. Yeah, it look like dirt. Oh, he like it. Look at the classroom. Remembering Shady Sands. Oh, wow. Ooh, California. 2189. 2198. Shady Sands become capital of the what? And see how it becomes a large economic and political. The fall of shady sand and then a bomb so the fall of shady sands was 2277 not a two-headed bear oh uh, excuse me what's going on it's a surface dweller tradition you can get a little rambunctious on my taste is it maximus The, look how they spell government. <laughs> this son bitch right here used to be the best bounty hunter to ever shoot a man in the ass. Kids these days don't know their goddamn history. Hey, you gotta hit my Sorry. We don't do a lot of knitting around here. It's called sewing. <laughs> right. Would you mind? Mmm. He gonna sew his finger and then kill all of y'all. Oh, maybe you're still looking for her. His wife. I sure as hell ain't still alive so that I can have unintelligent conversations with dipshits like yourself. <laughs> yeah. Whoa! Mind your fucking mouth. Oh my gosh! The president of the government. <laughs> Here, and there's a whole lot of chatter about some woman name of Mole Daly. Oh. He know that name too. They call her the Flame Mother. The Flame Mother? Now that bitch is dangerous. We have no idea these boys brought you in. Oh gosh, he's, he's still sewing his finger. The Fences Gang affiliated organ dealership. Yep. <laughs> now I've always liked you. Well, I've always liked you. Flame. Now you got anything to say in your defense? That he didn't do Guilty that. As charged, he like didn't do that. it. If you needed more evidence, I can tell you about this town I just shot up. Philly, oh, I must have killed nine or ten. <laughs> <laughs> well, not no more, he don't. Unless he's a coward. Uh oh. Don't take the bait, son. Well, I ain't fishing. I'm just trying to game this out, no? My daddy ain't no coward. Well, then I guess the only question is, 
Are you? Uh oh. Yep, I knew it. I knew it. I ooh, ooh. I knew it. I knew it. Woo! All right, Cowboy Cooper. <laughs> oh my Dover. You have this picture on your wall. That's Moldaver. Moldaver. Why? He know her. That's not how I remember her as well. Uh-oh. Well, how do you remember? Flashback. Come on, flashback. Yes. Hollywood forever. Funeral home, cemetery, cremation. Oh, so he's going to the meeting. Oh. All right. The door slide. Okay, what is this tradition? Oh. What? Is this like a church service? What kind of... What is this? This look like some type of seance or something. Hurry up, Cooper, get there. I wanna see. She think this is some fun something, but I, uh-uh. What? They are getting naked. What kind of, oh my gosh. What kind of foolishness is this? And she's taking her, <laughs> She only zipped the half away. What kind of cult mess is this? Moldaver. They're worshiping her. Oh, what is that? What is she drinking? Oh, she is drinking the blood. What is this, Viking? <laughs> yes, get out of there, Lucy. Yes. Editing Toya here. So I'm just realizing while editing that if Coop met her, that means she is 200 years old. How is this woman freaking still alive? What, what, what? What happened? Okay, back to the reaction. They are worshiping this lady. Her hair was cute, like pinned up. I like that. Lucy, go. Find Max, leave. Stop just looking. Go while everybody is down. It's about to go off. Okay, okay. You were right about this place. No. He want to stay. Check this out. These are called oysters. How they? How do they have oysters? Caviar. Oh. Sorry. Intercourse. Oh. That is. No, we need to leave right now. These people are insane. Yeah, they're like you, a little weird. Oh. Lost my arm. You know, I really, I ought to give it. Titus, I get why you'd want to stay. Okay, I really do. I I know this must all seem really nice compared to the, the shoe show that's up there, but this isn't it. They gave me a robe. <laughs> I know. And slippers. <laughs> These people are hiding something from us. I'm not leaving without you. She's going to go to level 12. It's a lab. <gasps> oh, 
Oh my gosh. Oh, Lucy. You got to get out of there right now. Was that the, the thing from the, the water? Is that a face? That's a face. Oh my gosh. Birth. That was there. Underwater birth. Piranhas? The hell? Oh my gosh, what is that? That's a person. I see boobs. What does it say on the thing? They got... Oh my gosh, look at all these tubes. <gasps> Somebody back there. Hot, hot, hot. To I mean Lucy. Lucy, go. The man with the nose. Lucy, go. Yes, please be quiet, girl. Her shoe, her shoe. He got a dang on harpoon. She was making all that dang on noise. Ooh! Yes! Come on, Lucy! She done been on the surface. Come on, Lucy, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, yes, come on, Lucy. Come on, come on. You're crazy. Oh, God, here she go. Your entire soldier is insane. I'm sure if we come to your home, yes, it's Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. And Max is just enjoying all of this. He is just having the time of his life. Eating popcorn, watching TV. Is that the end? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How is Lucy going to get out of this? How is Lucy going to get out of this? What is this? Fiddlesticks? Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, they're not really showing nothing. Oh my gosh. Alright folks, so that was episode 6. And we made it without a thunderstorm. It's just raining a little bit. But, oh my gosh. Lucy is in trouble. A world of trouble. I knew when they came to this vault, it wasn't all sunshine and rainbows. And Skittles and glitter and everything nice. Okay, because I'm like some fishy. First, Max peeped it out like, I think they don't want us to leave. And Luke's like, no, this is the vault. We're here, it's safe. Then she sl slowly started seeing things come about. Like the one-eyed man. The man with a nose on his forehead. The man with this creepy alien looking hand. Like, oh no. Then we saw Coop and his wife, you know, he... The face of vault -Tec, he's doing all the ads and things like that because he's not acting like he was before. And his wife, I don't remember he said her name, but his wife is all into what vault -Tec is doing, the vaults and everything. And she was like, I'm doing this so we can get into a good vault. What does that mean? So a good vault mean you'll be in, in the vault where the overseers that runs the rest of the vault where management is okay so yes so and i'm like uh oh this starting to be the divide between them two because coop is not really with it 
she is and she like i want to put us in a safe place with our family my loved ones you and my daughter because they like dogs can't come and he was like what dogs can't come so we're gonna have to leave the dog and go be safe which i i understood where she was coming from um then they had these parties people already had galaxy watches and um yes and then so we saw the ghoul how the ghoul got arrested and he um uh, went to I, I guess he's the president of the government and on that sign when they was taking him to the place they spell government like g-o-v-e-r-m-i-n-t <laughs> Government, not government, government, government. <laughs> that was funny to me. Um, so in there, he discovered Maldaver. He saw her picture that she was wanted because they're looking for her. And, and we find out she's the flame mother. And yeah, so I knew Coop Ghoul, Ghoul Coop, I'm going to call him Ghoul Coop was going to kill those two officers like y'all shut up and one of the officers was like philly my dad was in philly and he like your dad probably did because i killed about 10 people so we go back to the vault vault four because vault four when he did that commercial they were advertising showing how the vault is they had people already living in the vaults and so that was vault four so Vault 4, they like they they take in surfies, they call them, from the outside. They take them, bring them in, you know, give them a safe place and things like that. But then we go to this worship service that they was lighting candles. They was like it's a a, a outsider tradition or something like that. And so they go, they light candles, they doing this praise. They taking off their clothes and things like that. And lo and behold, who they worshiping? Maldaver. Because she is the flame mother. And I don't know what's their purpose of worshiping her. I don't, did they say it? Did I miss that? But Lucy like, we got to get out of here. She go to Max. Max is enjoying living in his own place, watching TV, eating caviar, Eating uh, oysters, which I don't know where they're getting that from. Eating oysters, uh, taking a hot shower, eating popcorn. He's clean. He don't have to fight. He don't have to do none of that. Oh, but they did find a suit, which I'm like, how the heck y'all found this suit? But anyway, Max is like, I don't want to leave yet. Plus my arm. It's got to rest some more. So she like, okay, there's something fishy going on. I'm going to find out about it and then we're going to leave because I'm not leaving here without you. So then she goes to level 12, the forbidden level that the the overseer told her no one can go to. And of course she goes, she sees, they recorded someone having a baby, but it was like fish, like piranha, because st they started eating her. And then she sees these tubes where they have women in there that are like pregnant I don't know how, like it's like a breeding thing and she gets caught of course the girl that was with the overseer I forgot her name with the long hair I knew something was fishy about her from the beginning she the leader of the the Maldaver cult and she I guess oversees the lab part and yes it is getting crazy Lucy got caught and then they go over to Max Max is, is just happy-go-lucky enjoying everything Oh, oh my gosh. I know seven and eight is going to be crazier. This one was an hour. The last two episodes was like 40 something minutes. This one was an hour. But yes, another great episode. I can't wait to see what seven and eight shows. But yes. So if you made it to the end of this video, thank you for watching to the end. I greatly appreciate it. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so I so I know, so you know when I drop a video. If you want to see the full unedited reaction, go ahead and click the link below for my Patreon. And if you want to further 
support the channel, click on my channel. Go to my channel here on YouTube and click my join. I can't look at that. Click the join button for my membership. Any form of support, I greatly appreciate it. And comment, comment, comment. Y'all be giving me stuff I miss. Somebody even broke down. I forgot your name. I probably put it up. Broke down the whole ghoul thing for me, which I thanked them for. I forgot it was a male or female. Thank them for it because that made me understand more of how they... I didn't even notice the ghoul didn't really have ears. But how his nose gone because the cartilage from them being so old it fell off. And yes, thank you again for breaking that down. So comment, like I said, and follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Herstyles with the Z15. And don't forget to keep being you, doing you, for you. And all right, folks, I'll see you on the next one. God bless.